Ah, my dear Charles. Mm, how terribly clever you are. Absolutely too deavy for words. Uh, I'm so glad you like them. By Jove, yes. Couldn't paint a boiled egg myself, and you've done all these? Can't think when you found the time. <laughs> did you frame them yourself? Oh, no, no, Mr. Shepard did that part. Ah, still, the painting's the hard part, isn't it? Deuce good, I must say. My dear, excuse me, my dear Lord Hazelmere, I do hope you're pleased with the way they're hung. Oh, yes, <laughs> excellent. Tadeus' work is quite striking, isn't it? Uh, rather undisciplined, somewhat lacking in finesse. Ah, uh, they quite make me shudder. I don't think I'd want to buy one to hang in my drawing room. I do know what you mean, my dear Eleanor. They are rather primitive, don't you think? Even shameless. Mr. Shepherd, I do believe you mean to shock us. Of course, Lady Williams. I hope I'm succeeding. <laughs> As you say, his work is certainly very striking. Won't you come and have a word with him? I know he'd be highly honoured. Yes, of course. Uh, will you excuse me? We'll look at all your lovely paintings while you're gone. Mm. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Lord Hazelmere, may I introduce Tadeus Sforsky? Tadeus, I know you'll be pleased to meet your fellow artist. How do you do? I think your pictures are splendid. They're not splendid. They're not good even, but a statement they make, something they be saying. All oh, paintings do that, surely. <laughs> oh. Ah, you think maybe uh, a camera be making statement? Uh, forgive me, uh, I've just seen Mr. Campoline. Just, Mr. Oh. But surely.